my name is Mathilde, welcome back to the Pixar Editing Labs and today I'm going to be showing you how you can color grade your pictures on your phone using Pixar. So make sure you stay tuned if you want to see how we go from this to this. The first method is using the adjust panel. Every time that I go to edit a photo, I make sure to first work on the shadows and the highlights. Shadows refer to the darkest part of your pictures. Moving on to highlights, you guessed it, this refers to the highlights in your pictures, so the lighter colors. Next step that I usually go for is the temperature. So this basically just makes your picture warmer or cooler. The thing with any color grading is to make sure that you do it moderately. If you make it super intense, it's gonna end up looking super blue or super orange. Speaking of colors, the next thing that I like to do usually is mess with hue. And you have to be very, 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 very delicate with this because if you go a little bit too strong, your picture's gonna end up looking like this. Saturation very much refers to what it sounds like. It makes your colors more saturated or less saturated. Clarity is gonna sharpen your photo. This is really useful if you took a picture that's a little bit out of focus and you just bring the clarity a little bit up. And then the next two are pretty basic features that most people are used to. So you can either bring the contrast up or down and same with the brightness a lot of people usually try to go for the brightness first when they edit their pictures that's why i said you should go for highlights and shadows because the result ends up looking more natural and less like you have a filter on it thank you guys so much for watching this video hopefully you can master how to color grade your own pictures and videos if you follow along to this tutorial don't forget to tag us on instagram and tiktok don't forget to like and comment and if you haven't already subscribed and i will see you next week bye